So let's take a look at uh, chapter one and what to kind of expect this week. So uh, I'm looking here in Canvas and uh, just to we'll kind of walk through this with you uh, very quickly. Uh, you'll see, oh, if you haven't seen this video up here, so the My Programming Lab and how it works, uh, check that out so you can see kind of what to do and, and uh, how to submit your assignments, that kind of stuff. So, uh, but rolling into chapter one, uh, well, there's this video, the activities video, and then uh, you'll see a PowerPoint here and the PowerPoint has different things in there that uh, this chapter is kind of basic stuff. Uh, usually what will happen is each chapter, the uh, the PowerPoints are, are, uh, are pretty important because I'll put links to code and example code and, and uh, different things to, for you to see in there. And so uh, you'll want to definitely want to make sure you check those out. So what I did this week is I made uh, the three videos that go along with it. I try to keep them, you know, five, 10 minutes. I got a little bit long winded on uh, the middle one. I think it's 17 minutes. I'm sorry. Uh, so just trying to go over some of this stuff and, and talk about a few things along the way. All right. So we've got that piece in there. I want to show you just really quickly the video links down here from um, Tony. So Tony got us our author and these are four videos that he included uh, for this uh, particular chapter, uh, introduction to flow charting, uh, designing with pseudocode. Uh, this video right here, the, de uh, designing the account balance program. I think that's another flow charting one. Uh, I think it's, you know, these are really short. So a couple minutes. Uh, I think this one's like a minute and a half, uh, predicting the result of problem 33. Uh, this video, I actually included this problem as part of the PowerPoint towards the end. Uh, so I mean, that's, you don't really need to see that one, but uh, if you really wanted to check it out, I think it's like a minute and a half. Uh, and then, uh, you, so, so work through work through those things, work through the chapter, uh, check this stuff out. Um, next, chapter two, we actually start, we'll start physically doing code. Uh, but for this, it's just, you know, kind of getting you started. And then you'll see two quizzes in here. So A and B, uh, honestly, they have... Uh, uh, some of the same questions in them. Uh, it's just meant as a little kind of activity for you. So take the quizzes. They're open book, open note. They're not timed. Uh, if you blow it, uh, you can retake it. And I just have them set up to keep the highest score. So it's really, um, you know, for you guys just to walk you through it, just to get you thinking a little bit on some of the stuff that uh, the chapter covers. Okay, and then at the very end, you'll see my programming lab. Again, my programming lab this week, there's not really coding in it. It's just uh, getting you to play around, uh, answering some questions, uh, like from terminology from the chapter. And, whoops, and uh, you'll see uh, some different different things in there. Okay, so I'm totally just jumping all over the place in here. Um, but you see, as you look through my programming lab, you'll see those little pieces in there. So again, make sure you watch this little video kind of at the end of the first module uh, before you jump into the chapter one stuff, just so you're familiar with my programming lab. But definitely go through this stuff first uh, before you tackle the tackle the quizzes uh, and, uh, and then my programming lab piece. And then um, that's pretty much it for this week. So relatively light week. I, I can tell by uh, just looking at the enrollment in my programming lab for this course that uh, most of you have gotten your your book and access to my program lab already so great so you can get rolling right along uh for those of you who haven't uh, you need to get them quickly so that you can keep going because we will uh start with coding next week uh again this isn't too bad uh kind of a light light week um believe me we'll have some weeks to make up for it uh but uh, but this will this will get you going with chapter one we'll do all chapter one and get it done this week and then we move on um you'll see some of this stuff later but uh for our actual coding introduction and getting you started with that stuff. So again, make sure you have uh, the REPL account. It's not that big a deal. You just sign up for an account, you're good to go. Uh, and then uh, I'll go through a little demo of how to use that and uh, some of the other pieces that we'll use starting next week too. Um, so you'll see those uh, pop up in the chapter two section uh, for next week. So anyway, so that's, uh, that's it. And if you have any questions, uh, please email me. Thank you.